All right, straight up win this stint. Goal three of stage three. The skipping cost is four, uh, 75 gold. It's gonna be a four lapper morning race. So, and the PR requirement is still at 84. So, um, let's see, I could hire Eric. In fact, why don't I do that? And four laps. I uh, wonder if I should hire the other guys too. You know what? We're still not at the end. I'll wait for a longer race possibly in maybe the remainder of the event possibility. So let's uh, get on with it, shall we? So morning race, usually a little bit easier to see than the night race, but uh, we'll see. Starting right in the middle of the Porsche curves. In third place, so we only need to overtake Ivanov. Second place. And whoever's in the lead. Alright. That looks like a beamer. And once again, we do have to rely on the headlights for the morning race here at the mall. Dawn is still fairly dark. Alright, we just done the chicken. Four laps, but the uh, rolling start didn't start started us as far back, so this is actually closer to the actual four laps. So that's that's good. These races are getting longer now. I don't really remember how many laps we've done already in this event. But uh, getting up there. Without a break, you know, this is about when your fatigue starts to really kick in, right? It's all dark still, so yes, it turns into a bit of a mental game at this point of uh, staying alert. Also staying on track, not just staying alert. There we go. Hello, Tom. How are ya? All right. You know what? Let's stay in the second place since he's uh, in another Porsche. I want to see what kind of drafting bonus we can get and what kind of top speed we can achieve with the, uh, this current 14 upgrade setup down 
Molson Street. So we'll get uh, now three chances to try it out. So this is now lap two of four. So alright, can you be my drafting partner? There we go. Alright. Come on, go, 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 go. I uh, forget it. You're useless. <laughs> I have this seat in the break of off my headlamps. So I need to find a better drafting partner it seems. But for now, I'll just go ahead and uh, win this stint just focus on the best lap time or something, something else. Considering that I'm in the lead, if the, the field is spread out wide enough, maybe I will begin to lap some of these slower opponents. We have four laps, that's a uh, um, good length. You know? So, yes, if you're not used to these long distance, long races, um, Combined with that uh, droning engine noise, uh, it's very uh, sleep-inducing, you know. So uh, when I used to farm a lot more with the LMP ones, uh, yes, I'll find myself waking up, staring at one of these uh, uh, side uh, vents. <laughs> Uh, yep. I know. Things that we used to do, but uh, not really doing that much anymore, if at all. I haven't done 10 lap or farming in a long time. But I have been doing other endurance, uh, um, other events in that endurance legend section, using those LMP ones to at least see if I can get this series completed at some point. And uh, now that they uh, removed the time limit on the Road to Le Mans event, I might actually uh, do a run through of that series as well, but uh, at the moment, these, all these limited time series and special events and flashback, they're all kind of keeping me busy, so I don't know if I'll ever get around to it, but uh, I will try, since I still don't own the one of the best. I have owned it before. But uh, thanks to my account getting messed up, the cloud save getting messed up, um, I call it getting stolen, the car's getting stolen, so <laughs> I won it, but then it was taken away, so um, I had to start over. So here we are, without the, uh, those uh, possibly the most balanced car in the game, the 2014-919 hybrid. Can't say that, I wish I could say the same about the 2015 version, but 2015 handles a little bit, um, well, it doesn't handle as well as a 2014 version, for whatever reason. The handling is one of the wattier cars, I think. But uh, 
yeah, I don't know how to quite describe it. You have to try it yourself to um, understand what I mean. So, if you already own that car, you might understand. Well, especially in comparison to 2014 version. Obviously, if you've never driven 2014, there's nothing to compare to. You might just say, like, yeah, it drives fine. But uh, when you have driven 2014, you definitely notice the difference between the two years. And it's not definitely for the better. <laughs> it was in game. Alright. I think we're beginning to about, to, yep, we're beginning to laugh. Uh, some slower opponents. At least one. So we're about to head in, uh, wrap up this uh, lap four, and head into the final lap of the stint. Uh, I guess it's gonna wrap another one. That's a Porsche. Try not to crash into them. go the final lap. It takes about three minutes of change for a lap uh, without trying too hard, of course. Looks like we might overtake yet another opponent. That's another Porsche, what was it? Yep. Am I gonna get drafting bonus from you. Uh, not so much, but uh, there's another guy that I'm about to overtake in the front. A beamer. So I don't know how much help I'm going to get there. A little bit. 3.5, 6, 7. Yep, that's about all I'm going to be able to pull off there. have built up some two kilometers plus of lead. Which is a rather large lead. So we'll have to do something about that. And since this challenge does not have any other stipulations like um, having to maintain certain average speed or anything like that, I think I might just park uh, at the end and wait for the second place can to close in Let's wrap it up that way where it seems like the top speed tends to top off. Alright, almost two and a half kilometers of lead. And now 2.5 kp uh, kilometers plus of lead. So that's what about a how long is this long track? About 10 kilometers, maybe? Alright, there's a uh, Ford. Oh, nope. Yep, that is a Ford. The piggy face that you cannot unsee. Uh, pit lane? Check it out behind the barrier. Nope, nothing.
Guess not, huh? Pit lane here, maybe. Oops. Oh, hello. Ten has caught up while I was messing about. But there we go. 14 minutes, 23 seconds and change. The payout is pretty decent. I'm expecting a decent fame bonus as well. 9100 points, so that is pretty good. Large enough to make the, the, the fame bar uh, actually move at my level. Because <laughs> most races don't. You know, you see it pretending to move, but it's, you know, pretty minuscule. But here we are. All right, so that's a win. Pretty cool. Good job, Eric. And that is that for the goal three, the first morning race of the event. So, oh, look at that goal four to wrap up stage three. Skipping cost is now up to a hundred gold. Wow. And uh, look at that. We got a fuel management goal to wrap up stage three. And oh, we need more upgrades. Yep. So this is where the third tier upgrades are going to have to kick in. So obviously either I'll have to wait three hours and 19 minutes or spend 70 gold to get them done right away, which I'm not going to do. Uh, or watch ads, which I think I might do. So I will return momentarily. So stay tuned uh, for the next final race of stage three.